All right, morning. Do something a little bit different today, so it's not the same old thing. I'm gonna do this whole thing a little bit more vlog style. Okay, I've already started the car. Obviously, as you can see, my uniform. Um, today is a day of work, so won't be a terribly long video, but we'll uh, we'll get things going nonetheless. All right. There we go. We're ready to go. All right, we're on our way to work. Looks to be a very nice day. Working <clears throat> eight in the morning till seven at night tonight. Today's Friday, so should be a little bit more traffic than normal. But we'll ultimately see what what things look like. Well, I haven't checked in in the last couple of days on what the exact numbers of uh, positive cases are. I know the worldwide number is over a million. I'm not sure exactly what the US number is. I'm sure it's well over 300,000 at this point. All I can do is just try to keep me from getting sick. So instead of you just staring at me as I drive, I'm gonna turn the camera out and put it out towards the, um, the road. Looking at me is kind of boring, so I think going forward, I'm gonna go ahead and point the camera out so you can see as daily life changes or see the traffic level change as, as this thing evolves. We're pretty much heading for the height of it. We're still going up in terms of uh, cases. So we haven't leveled the, the spread just yet, but it's about 7.30 now. So normally, traffic is very, very heavy on this road because it is the morning commute. But uh, anyway, let me go ahead and turn the camera around and uh, we'll continue talking on the other side. Now we're talking. I've got the camera set back close to my face. Um, so you're getting a lot of other stuff in the shot. You're getting my dashboard and you're getting... Um, in the upper right hand corner you're getting the mirror on my on my dashboard so apologize for that i'll fix that on the next ride but um so yeah i think this is a better idea rather than you looking at my face i'll just talk and and you can watch the traffic go by again i've only worked one out of the last five days so in terms of work I don't really have a whole lot to say other than I guess we'll see when we get there what things are looking like until I have something to say I'm gonna go ahead and shut off the camera so at quarter of eight this road is normally very busy I would say this is definitely very light traffic compared to what it normally is at this time of the day so People are heeding the warnings, although it's not unilaterally and universally. But for the most part, people are staying at home. Okay, well, listening to that little bit of news, sounds like things in Washington are going about as well, about as good as they have been over the last couple of weeks. So that's enough of that. On my way home now, it's uh, approaching sunset. Uh, it's a little after 7.30 at the moment. And a uh, very slow day for a Friday at the store. And yesterday was a very slow day as well, particularly for a Thursday. So, people are definitely staying at home. I think once the government checks start hitting mailboxes and, and bank accounts, we're going to start seeing a surge in, in, uh, in grocery buying again, but right now I don't see um, that happening as of yet. Um, obviously, we, we haven't gotten our check yet, so I, I know that's not the case. Um, a little bit of a hiccup in the truck schedule though. We were supposed to get a frozen truck today and we got word this morning that we weren't getting the frozen truck 
today, it was gonna come tomorrow. But then, a couple of hours later, the frozen truck showed up. So we ended up getting it today after all, but by the time it showed up, most of the people that normally work that truck were all gone home for the day. So I didn't end up working any of my frozen trucks. So the plan tomorrow is, is to go ahead and work that truck tomorrow when when all the rest of the uh, the associates from the frozen department get their stuff underway. So that'll be on the plan for tomorrow. But today was a fairly slow day, so I got caught up on some back stock. I made some, uh, you know, made some extra products so our bakers don't have as much to do tonight. Um, and just generally, uh, you know, worked on some other things today. There's, there's always something to do in our department, so. Um, so I worked on other things other than the truck, and I'll do the trucks tomorrow. Very light traffic though for 7.30 at night. Oh God, look at this guy. So I have this dash cam in my car and when I see someone doing something stupid, I'm able to press a button on the camera and it saves the video from that particular minute. I'm gonna make some YouTube videos in the future that, that will compile all of those stupid drivers that I, I personally see and call them out. I'm going 72 and that guy was going, as fast as he came up on me, he had to have been going at least 90. So yeah, there really isn't a whole lot going on today or tonight. I'm right back in tomorrow morning at uh, seven or eight in the morning scheduled at 9 but I'm gonna go in at least an hour early maybe even two depending on uh, how much sleep I get tonight so but tonight I'm gonna go home get caught up on the news of the day have some dinner relax a little bit I need to get working on some editing so might knock out a couple videos tonight and then it'll just be generally relaxing the rest of the night so Pretty boring day overall. This is why I don't do daily vlogs very often because there just isn't a whole lot to do at home. And can't go anywhere anyway, so, or not supposed to. Although a lot of people generally are. But as you can see, the traffic is pretty light. If you take away the trucks that are on the road, there's very few cars. People are heeding the warning and staying home, staying away from each other. All right, I'm gonna call it a video and enjoy the ride, the rest of the ride home. It is a nice evening, it's about 70 degrees right now, so very nice spring evening. So, that's it for now.